Hi guys and welcome back to the World Entertainment. Ada Tomi, an abroad-based Nigerian lady, cries out for justice after her family home was set alight when her family was sleeping inside around 3 a.m. by her ex-boyfriend, who she has a restraining order against. Her mother, two older sisters, three nieces and her two kids were inside the house, but likely they all survived. She posted this on her Twitter page. I don't know how to tell you all without saying it. My ex-boyfriend, who I have a restraining order against, set my family house is on fire while my family was inside. My mother, my two older sisters, my three nieces, and my two kids were all home in bed when at 3 a.m. someone threw a cocktail bomb in the back of our home. This is what left absolutely nothing. One house completely sent and the other roof caved in from fire and water damage. If you are in the South Jersey area and you would like to donate clothes, food, prayers, please contact me. My mother been living that house since she was 18. She is now 57. House next door is the house she was raised in. Both gone. Restraining orders are definitely useless. It's scary. It's like soon as I got restraining order, it got worse. Go find me, my niece created. It's my personal cash app. If you are in the South Jersey area, I could message an address to bring things to. Bullets in front of home. Cocktail bomb at the back. We have nothing. This monster took our home away from us. We are accepting clothes, food, and cash, and prayers. Thank you. It's scary and things need to change. We need better law to protect women. I am safe now, but I am broken. I'm scared. I'm embarrassed. I can't eat. I've been throwing up all day. If you can assist with anything, a screenshot of a GoFundMe will be on this video and on the description below. We hope they get justice and we are happy that they all survived. Until next time, peace.